How do we calculate a probability of profit? POP is industry standard traditional method of probability of profit. It is just a range that looks at an option trade structure to expiration. Included in this calculation is the current volatility of the trade assets. Then it is plugged into a model, which is usually the Black-Scholes. From this probability range, um, volatility is calculated and superimposed over a risk profile. Using this method, you're skipping everything day to day, waiting to arrive at expiration. Let's look at the shortfalls of traditional POP calculation. It assumes the distribution model is perfectly centered, and it is not. It assumes volatility will not change, and we know that it will. It includes an unacceptable amount of risk within probability zone. Be careful with how much risk you can assume in a trade for it to be favorable risk to rewards. It also assumes no large moves will occur in a single day, and we know that it will, and we've seen that it has. We'll look at a couple charts on the calculation of POP and why it does not work for the retail option trader. Here is an iron condor um, with the traditional industry calculation of POP. This particular POP is rated at standard of 76%. When you look at this trade, it includes all the risk to the left, where this trade could get behind up to 30%, and to the right. If we have a flash crash of a negative 10% in a matter of minutes, this trade will be at the 1800 level, meaning it will lose about 80% instantly. This is where most brokers and popular educators advertise that this is a, a high probability type of trade, but it's greatly misleading the public when we know that this is not a safe trading strategy. This is what happens to this high probability condor, supposedly an amazing and safe strategy. We see that a flash crash will destroy this trade within an immediate 80% loss. Or if it's your entire account, then you will lose that much if you have only one large trade on. So, as we can see, a slow 10% grind down in 30 days will result in a 100% loss if, it's, if this trade is not managed. Again, the POP gives you a high probability because it assumes you are not going to manage the trade and stop any possible loss. This is one of the most popular trades taught in the world. During October and November of 2014, where the SPX rebounded 10% immediately after the 10% drop, this caused another huge problem for Condor traders as a 10% move up also results in an 80% to 100% loss of this trade. So our founder has developed a concept resulting in the real pop, which is realistic probability on profit, removing the, uh, the large risk in uh, the probability zone, and actually giving you um, stop managed loss rules to be able to aid you through the duration of your trade. Our method of our pop, realistic probability on profit is over 80% probability, where that popular method of the iron condor, if you take out the assumed 30% risk on either side of that trade, is only a 40% probability on profit. So don't be fooled by this traditional calculation of pop when this method cannot possibly work because it assumes every trade has the same risk within the probability array, which is entirely wrong. 
and when it doesn't work as an effective calculation of probability for option traders. If you're using this method and you are skipping everything day to day, waiting to arrive at expiration date, you may pop.